Countdown clock is in for the afternoon's 13th race. A field of seven, three-year-old fillies for a purse of $9,200. Let's go back upstairs to Vance Cameron. Missing Julie, Wickham's Irish Piece of Heaven, Woodmere Luna, Sugar Roll, Salzburg Pickup. First Philly chip is outside. Top of the stretch. Here they come. The rough and pacing. Wickham is the first one out. Second is Irish Piece of Heaven. Missing Julie along the rail third. Coming from the outside. First Philly Chip will enter the turn fourth. To get away fifth is Woodmere Luna. Then it's Sugar Roll six. And the trailer is Salzbrook Picka on the back stretch for time one. Wickham at the rail, the lead is short-lived. Here's Murner and Zars Piece of Heaven to take over top spot. Wickham now second, missing Julie is third. That is first Philly Chip to drop in fourth. Woodmere Luna is fifth, Sugar Roll is sixth, Salzbrook Picka is seventh, and here's Mark Campbell now. He's right-lining Wickham to put her back on the top off a of 29. And two-quarter mile. Second is ours, piece of heaven. Missing Julie comes out of the turn third. Fourth, along the rail is first Philly chip. Woodmere Luna has fifth. That is Sugar Roll six. And the trailer seventh. Salzbrook pick a halfway home in the 13th. And the leader is Wickham. Here's Missing Julie up to challenge that leader. In the pocket, Zars piece of heaven is third. 60 seconds flat was the opening half mile. New leader at 5-8. Mixing Julie takes over for Claire McDonald. Wickham now is second. Up third on the outside. That is first Philly Chip at the rail. Fourth. Zars piece of heaven. Nowhere to go. Woodmere Luna's moving fifth. Now to take over six. Salzbrook Pickett and the trailer. That is Sugar Roll. They go by three quarters. Mixing Julie is the leader. Three quarters went one. 29 and four as they round the turn for the final time. Eighth of a mile to go. Missing Julie turning home. Second is first Philly chip on the outside. Woodmere Luna comes late third. Down the stretch they come. Missing Julie. Woodmere Luna up the inside. First Philly chip as they come to the wire. Woodmere Luna in the final stride here for Kenny Murphy. Second was missing Julie. First Philly chip got up third. Two minutes. One fifth. Here comes a slow-mo replay for the afternoon's 13th race, brought to you by Universal Media. There was some give and goes. Zars Piece of Heaven went to the front, released by Wickham, and then Wickham came back around, 29-2. The half up in a minute. There was movement as Missing Julie moved out, clear to the front, going by the 5-8s, 3 quarters, 129-4, and, and then they're going to battle in the stretch here. We'll see Woodmere Loon up on the outside, battling Miss Ju Missing Julie. And Woodmere Luna, Kenny Murphy in the bike for the win this afternoon. Trainer Joe Baxter, birthday boy, celebrating the win. In for second, missing Julie. Out of the Claire McDonald stable, Erith Riley from Summerside, the owner. And first, Philly Chip in there for third. But we're going to see Woodmere Luna and Kenny Murphy in the Woodmere Standard Bread's winner's circle next. Have the late judge's inquiry now in the 13th race. Possible interference three on five after three quarters. Oh. 
Well, between Kenny, Joe, Cheryl, and Luna, they pull a major upset here in the 13th race. Woodmere Luna's going to the winner's circle. Pacing Black Philly 3 by Arthur Blue Chip is from the Western Paradise Dam. A shadow dancer on by Cheryl Smallman of Kensington, bred by Woodmere Farms of Marshfield. The birthday boy himself, Joe Baxter, does the conditioning. Kenny Murphy will get her to the winner's circle and give her a new record of two minutes and a one-fifth. Woodmere Luna in a PEI Colt Stakes shocker at Summerside. <laughs>